Well, it was hot out there today again, and it is going to be nice and hot tonight for Mr. Worldwide in Paso Robles. But right now out at the beach, we can see that it's definitely hot. I don't know. The camera just turned, but I saw some people not just waiting in the water, but fully submerged. So that's how you know it is really hot here on the central coast. And that heat is going to continue until tomorrow at 8 p.m. During that time, we're looking at temperatures reaching from the 90s all the way to 105 degrees. So that advisory was supposed to expire last night, but it has been extended to tomorrow at 8 p.m. So something to keep in mind if you are going to be hanging out in the interiors, especially Paso Robles for the fair. Current temperatures here on the central coast, triple digits in Cuyama and Paso Robles, upper 90s for California Valley and Shandon, a little bit cooler out toward the coast in the 60s, 75 in San Luis Obispo. Now, if we look ahead to tomorrow, we see not a lot of relief here across the state. We're looking at triple digits in Palm Springs, 115, triple digits in Fresno and Bakersfield as well, 90s for Los Angeles and Sacramento. Again, a little bit cooler here on the central coast in the 80s for tomorrow but overnight that's when we're going to see that relief in the 50s tonight san luis obispo at 55. right now in san luis obispo it is sunny and 75 degrees out there a little bit of cloud cover off the 101 northwest winds 14 miles per hour let's take a look at our highs since midnight reaching the triple digits for paso robles at 101 degrees 80s for santa barbara san luis obispo not quite reaching 80 and 91 for santa inez now for the next three days we are looking at 60s out at the beaches, a 20 degree jump from the beaches to the coastal areas in the 80s, and a nearly 40 degree jump in some areas from the beaches to the inland areas where we're looking at triple digit temperatures over the next three days. Current wind speeds on the central coast, relatively calm, double digits in Cuyama. Winds are picking up in Paso Robles, hopefully providing a little bit of relief for that heat. Our peak wind speeds for today, double digits in Santa Maria and Santa Inez, Paso Robles at 15, San Luis Obispo, 17 miles per hour. Now looking ahead to the coastal valleys, we're going to see some clouds in that early morning hour, but they should clear by the late morning. We're looking at sunny skies throughout the afternoon, highs in the 80s. Interior valleys, this is where we're going to feel the heat reaching those triple digits by 3 p.m. The south coast, a little bit cooler in the 70s for the high tomorrow in the west beaches. This is the place to go to beat the heat starting off the day in the 50s, not seeing much of a warm up, only getting up to 60 degrees for the high tomorrow. Our 24 hour temperature change is showing all areas cooling down for the most part. Cambria staying the same. San Luis Obispo, 12 degrees down. Santa Maria at 7. Our area forecast for tomorrow, still looking pretty hot, but not quite as hot as earlier this week. Paso Robles hitting 102. Overnight lows in the 50s. San Luis Obispo, 82 for the high tomorrow. Along the north coast in the 60s for the high. Five cities area looking at highs in the low 60s and 70s. Along the south coast, we're looking at some areas heating up. Cuyama in the triple digits. Seven day forecast showing Paso in the triple digits, San Luis Obispo in the 80s for this week, Santa Maria consistently in the 70s, and Santa Barbara sunny and 78 for the high tomorrow. Take the KSBY microclimate weather forecast with you. Download the free app today.